I've got on full cover tips from Beatles and I've buffed them because we'll be using gel and gel won't adhere to a shiny surface. I picked out two gorgeous colours, uh, dip colours from Beatles and we're going to be using these today with a base gel and we are going to combine them to turn them in to like a coloured overlay on these tips. I'm going to be using these paper cupcake liners and they're really easy to use because they're disposable. I want to catch all the powder that drops off. I don't want to waste anything. I'm going to do the nails slightly differently. On three of them, at the fun, I'm going to go straight into the dip powder with uh, a thin coat of gel from Nao first, base gel. Uh, you can't actually dip your finger in the pot like you would with the traditional dip system uh, because otherwise the gel will sort of mush and go everywhere. So we're just going to do a thin layer of that first. We're not going to cure this. And I'm just going to get the cupcake liner underneath so we don't make too much mess. And I'll definitely put a paper towel underneath as well so you can just throw everything away afterwards. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to spoon this over the nail and just shake off the excess. You want to give it a few seconds to absorb and check your nail from side to side to ensure that you've covered it evenly. Put it in the lamp and give it a cure. If this is your personal product, you can just grab the liner and put the uh, powder back in the pot. I'm just going to repeat the same process on my index finger and my pinky. I'm going to repeat the process on all the three fingers so they get two nice even coats of powder. The other two fingers I'm going to do it slightly differently. I'm going to be using the Beatles um, base coat because it's a bit thinner and this is actually the one that I often use with dip powder and I'm going to give that a thin coat and cure it. So just like the first uh, three nails I went in with another coat of base coat that I didn't cure and <laughs> I've kind of lost my patience now so I'm just going to sit and tip the jar over the nail on the next two fingers. So I'm going to do that on both of them and just cure it in between. Now, usually two coats is enough, but I had to do three because I had a black stain left on my nails that I just wanted to cover. So let's just give them a good wipe. Now we're done. I just want to go over them with a quick file and this is just like 180 grit and just crispen up the shape a little bit and get rid of any lumps and bumps, but do not be heavy handed. This will file off easily. And this is the final result after I've done finished my line work and put some bling on it. I think they are absolutely gorgeous.